For Bangladesh, COVID has been devastating. We lost many colleagues. Public health infrastructure has been overwhelmed. Vaccinations were not available on time. We needed a solution that is low cost and can be rolled out easily across the country. And that's where masks come in. How do we get people to change their behavior? I'm from Bangladesh and have friends and family members all over South Asia. So it was natural for us to put our research resources to try and address that problem. We tried over a dozen different strategies and we randomized with 350,000 people across 600 villages in Bangladesh to see what was most effective. We found a set of four strategies that persistently increased mask usage. We used the acronym NORM, so N for no cost mass distribution, O for offering information in the process, R for reinforcement, and M for role modeling by community leaders. We found it more than tripled mask usage in rural Bangladesh, and we later found out that this increase led to a reduction in COVID, especially for the older population. Behavior change is not an easy thing to do. Large scale changes require continuous reinforcement. It often works when people actually hear it from people that they trust within their community. We took these results and we reached out to governments all over South Asia and then jointly formed the coalitions to implement the project to reach over 100 million people within a few months. IPA has been a critical partner in ensuring the success of these scale-ups in various cities. We will do it and we will be able to save many more lives in the villages. Now we have a cheaper mask that was also more effective at reducing COVID. We are able to reduce COVID transmission much more cost effectively. A large implementing organization like BRAC partnered with an organization like IPA. We did the pilot, then we scaled it up. If we could do that for all the policy areas, we would have much broader impact. 